Here are the top news headlines for the day. Prime Minister Shunarendra Modi has invited youngsters to know and contribute to Yuva Prime Minister's scheme for mentoring young authors and national scheme for nurturing young learners for future leadership roles. The scheme envisions cultivating modern ambassadors of Indian literature as the country heads towards 75 years of independence. India is ranked third in the arena of book publishing and to further boost this treasure trove of indigenous literature, youngsters will be mentored through the Yuva scheme. The scheme is aimed at training 75 aspiring writers below 30 years who are ready to express themselves and project India and its culture and literature globally. A consolidated scholarship of 50,000 per month for a period of six months per author will be paid under the mentorship scheme. The Pradhan Mantri Karib Kalyan Anni Yojana has been extended till the Pavli. Up to November, 80 crore people will continue to get free food grain every month. The Government of India announced Pradhan Mantri Garib Kalyan Anni Yojana to ameliorate the hardship faced by the poor due to economic disruption caused by coronavirus. The Government of India will bear the entire cost on account of such distribution including food subsidy, intrastate transportation and dealers' margin without any sharing by states and union territories. The Government of India has placed fresh orders for 440 million jabs. The government has placed an order with Serum Institute of India for 250 million doses of Covishield and with Bharat Biotech for 190 million doses of Covaxin. These 440 million doses of vaccines will be available till December 2021, starting now. Additionally, 30% of the advance for procurement of both the COVID vaccines has been released to Serum Institute and Bharat Biotech. The centre has already placed an order to purchase 300 million vaccine doses from Biological E recently, which will be available by September.